Okay, we know that Oregon has many, many, many great breweries, but there are some even in Oregon City. That's right. Rod is in Oregon City this morning. He's been hanging out at one of my favorite restaurants there. It's Mi Familia. Yep. But Rod, another great Oregon City spot, has paid a visit to yes. you there. We're talking yes. about coin toss brewing now. Yes, uh, I had coffee earlier. No, I hope it's okay, America. We're having beer. <laughs> All right, so Tim Ho joins us. And uh, Tim, you just got into the craft beer business about four years ago, you were saying. Yeah, this is a second career for me. All right. Uh, and uh, we are super excited to be a uh, part of the craft, the growing craft beer community here in Oregon City. All right, pour me up, sir, if you would, and All tell right. me what we're pouring this morning. All right, this is our half penny lager. Because uh, rumor has it, I know you're a, you're a big Bud Light drinker. I've been known to drink a Budweiser, too. So this is what we call a gateway beer for uh, Bud Light yellow beer drinkers. You're trying to get us away from... Absolutely. Okay. All yeah. right. What am I going to be tasting here? So this is our light lager. This is our lightest beer. Very beautiful light nice color. A blonde, light blonde color, I would Absolutely. say. Absolutely. Made with a little flaked rice, so it has a little sweetness. Well, it's very easy to drink. Mm-hmm. And it, yeah, it's... Um, I want to say I almost need something heavier. It's so <laughs> <laughs> well, Come on, Mr. Bud Light, really? Are you joking? Bud Light's the hard stuff, you know. Come on. <laughs> no, I do like that. It's very, very, very drinkable. Mm. How many different beers do you make? Uh, we usually have 12 on tap at our tap room. Uh, constantly rotating with the season, but the, the half penny lager uh, is one of our mainstays. It's always on tap. We have, we have three different IPAs because, of course, it's Oregon, so and you have to have IPAs. You're here in the downtown area of Oregon City. We're actually up on top of the hill. Oh, that's, that's yeah. right, up on the, okay. Yeah, up, uh, up uh, near Clackamas Community College, okay. uh, right off Beaver Creek Road. Hey, real quick, I ask you, because you were telling me you're not a restaurant, you're all about being a tap room and mm -hmm. people coming in and enjoying the beer. And I said, do you have TVs around for sports? And you said to me, no, we do not. We purposefully do not have a television because beer to me is a very uh, community oriented thing. You should be able to come into our tap room, hang out, talk with your friends, uh, meet your neighbors, just have a quiet beer if you'd like. But, I'm getting closer uh, because you're talking about being chummy <laughs> as we drink our beer. I mean, we've got people who came in, who come into our tap room who are, uh, started as complete strangers and now are uh, best of friends. So it's, it's really uh, fantastic to see. Do you ever have pizza with your beer? Absolutely. Yeah, let's bring in some more of that uh, fine right. wood oven fired pizza. All right, Coin Toss Brewery. Tim Hole is second career. Very tasty, my friend. Cheers, Rod. Thank you very much. Chris McGinnis, I'm told that you're actually working this morning. Is that true? Yeah, and you're working pretty hard, I can see. All right, enjoy that at one of uh, Oregon's newest breweries. All right, let's get to the, the radar right now. We